What's going on guys, Andrew here. Welcome back to Around the Track. This is where we talk about all the hot and new things going on within the coastal community. Today we're gonna to be talking about delirium at King's Dominion. The question is, is it going to be removed? Because this thing's been down for a hot minute. Like we don't even know if it's the motor, if it is the motor, they've had plenty ample of time to get this thing replaced. It, I don't know what's really going on. If it does get removed, I'm not even gonna be mad at it because I'm gonna tell you what I don't really like about this ride. It's probably the worst free spin I've honestly ridden. The ride duration is the shortest ride duration I've done on any free spin. I don't know why it feels like the shortest duration. And even at its peak height, it's like not even like a super high pendulum ride. It's shorter than the one at Kings Island. It's shorter than most of the pendulum rides actually. On top of that, this thing fits 40 riders. Believe it or not, this little pendulum ride fits 40 riders on here. And when I tell you, I've had it where there was almost 40 people on this ride, and I kid you not, you could barely move your arms. Like everyone essentially has to be skinny. One last thing on this ride, <laughs> when I tell you, as a man, whew, this thing gets tight down there, okay? There was only one other ride at this park that used to do that, and that was the Crypt or Tomb Raider for those in the OG, the OG days of Kings of Minion. It's legit been i think two seasons now where this has been down either you're gonna fix it or they're not you know it's like at this point when they leave something like that for that long they did that with a, i think hurler but hurler we saw what they were doing with hurler you know this isn't a this is an rmc type of retheme that you're gonna do for this free spin in fact the year delirium got there that was when I started working at King's Dominion, believe it or not. It's crazy because everything in that plot of land seems to disappear. Remember Shockwave? If you don't remember Shockwave, you're probably too young. But yeah, Shockwave was actually a really fun stand-up coaster that I wish that was still at the park, to be honest, because the layout for it was great. It had this double helix that was so fun. Since King's Dominion doesn't really want to give you an update right now, hopefully we'll get one really soon. But I wanted to give you all at least some idea what could be happening let me know in the comments section below i'd love to hear what you have to say don't forget to like share subscribe and until next time peace out